Blessings to you, my brothers and sisters. Today, I want to talk about making amends. I've been hearing the Lord speak on making amends. So if you had a relationship or if your last conversation with your family or friends or whoever it is that is still bothering you that did not go so well and you wanted to go back and make amends, you wanted to go back and apologize or you wanted to go back to to just make it well again, but you haven't had a chance, especially during the season when we were all isolated. You haven't had the opportunity, so you've been skipping it. You haven't followed through and done it. Now is the time, brothers and sisters, even if it's a phone call, even if it's on video conference, now is the time to make your amends because you never know. You never know when that person's last day is. You never know when your last day is on this earth. So make an amends for yourself and for the person and your family, whoever it is. If this has been on your heart to make amends, to make your last conversation with that person better than, when, than what you left it at, Go ahead, go ahead and send that text, send that message to schedule something, to make amends so that your last phone call, your last interactions with them will not be full of regrets and full of heartbreak. That it will, that it will be a good, a good goodbye if it was the last. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, for pulling on your people's hearts right now for humbling, helping us to humble ourselves, to make that amend, to, to text, to message, and to, to be, to be the bigger person, to be you, God, to be what you would have us do, Lord, to be the love and the light and the salt of this world. I thank you, Jesus, that we are not of the world. We thank you, Jesus, that you have made us different, that you have walked with us, that you transform our hearts, you transformed us, God, and that you have lead us. Holy Spirit, guide us, guide us in our conversations, guide us and talk to us about how that needs to go. I thank you, Jesus, for for my brothers and sisters' courage and strength to make that amend, to have that last phone call, to be better, be better, just better, even if it's a little bit better. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus, that they will be strong and brave to make amends to whatever has been tugging in their heart with their last phone call with their mom or dad or sister, or brother or friend, whoever it is that God, you lay on their hearts right now to know exactly who they need to call to wrap up that conversation better. I thank you, Jesus. Even if, even if you two or a group of people, even if today is not your last day, even if it's 10 years from now, 30 years from now, it will still be well that you made the amends. It will still be well. It, it will not hurt the relationship, but it will strengthen the relationship. I thank you, Jesus, for bringing courage and boldness to my brothers and sisters right now and strengthen their relationships with their family, their friends, whoever they interact with. I thank you, Lord, that you help them find the right words to speak, Lord, and also know, know when to not to speak. Thank you, Jesus, that that we are making amends. We are. We are following your voice and being the love. Thank you, Jesus, that we are able to love others just as you love us. In the name of Jesus. I love you, brothers and sisters. But Jesus loves you even more.